you know, I can be honest with you. Sometimes when I look at the skies, I receive messages. The cloud. Some nights, the Holy Ghost leads my eye to look at stars and their alignment. And I receive messages. For Jeremiah, he told him, go to the house of the potter. Go to the house of the potter. While the man was making a clay pot, then the clay fell and the pot lost shape. The man scattered the whole mud and started recreating a new item. God said, this is my message to you. As you have seen this portal do to this clay, go and tell Israel that I can, I can change and I can make into any form. I am the potter. You are the clay. You don't know where your messages come from. It's not every spiritual message that they must route it through a scripture. Sometimes no time for you to go and carry a, a scripture. No, the message is too quick and your intervention should be too quick. So they will, they will just use the color of somebody's shirts as you just looked at this. Ah, suddenly understanding enters your heart. That same red shirt that is red every day when you look at that one on that day an unusual message quick i hope you know that in the realm of visions and dream the meaning of everything is in that time you are looking at it in the realm of dream you can be seeing a pencil one pencil just one pencil no hand holding the pencil and looking at that pencil the meaning of the pencil enters your soul as you are looking at it it is foolishness to wake up and come back here and go and meet another man and say sir anytime you see pencil what does it mean the most accurate source of that interpretation is the place you went out from. And it is hidden in your soul. Has anybody interpreted a dream for you before? Do you know that when interpretations are suggested because it's just a suggestion, there is a way you, your spirit agrees when you hear the right interpretation. You, something in you just say yes. This is the matter of this issue. Sometimes the Holy Ghost is trying to give you and you see, you see when, when a matter is too quick to be decided when, when, when they want to give you the capacity to interfere in matters that require urgency they are most likely not going to use the conventional route of information. So a spiritual man must be sensitive 24 hours. Sometimes it's a sound you will hear and you will hear thus says the Lord that sound, a message will come with it. A brother came and shook my hands. As he shook my hands like this and held my hand firm and the Lord gave me a message. Pick his voice from everything. Everything is serving God. Pick, even Satan can become a messenger of God. Pick his voice. Be searching for God's voice from everything. And he said, day I came back, I went to drink water. I left the kitchen. I was going, you know, to my room. And I started feeling thirsty again. I said, but I just took water now. As I went back to the kitchen and I took water to drink, the Holy Ghost told me that the same way this water didn't satisfy you, I will put a test for you. A test for me in your life. In this new season, you will, you will look for me with unquenchable zeal. Did I, did I read it in any Bible verse? No. My ear is always waiting. He says I will stand upon my watch and I will wait to see what he will say. Ah, your normal life is, is a watch life. You are just waiting. What will he say? What will he say? Sometimes a one billion dollar business opportunity is just in that single moment of discernment. Small discernment. 